Following new details in that investigation at Joel Olstein's megachurch, officials have identified the woman who opened fire before being killed by law enforcement. And they now say that seven-year-old boy injured in the shooting was her son. ABC's Myra Variel has the latest from Houston. This morning, new video reveals the terrifying scene inside Joel Osteen's Houston megachurch, Lakewood, during a shooting rampage that wounded two. The shooter who was killed inside the church is now identified as 36-year-old Genese Moreno. She brought her seven-year-old biological son with her Sunday. Police say it's unclear who shot the boy, but confirmed he sustained a severe head wound. Parishioners seen trying to escape and screaming in terror. Gunshots going off just as a Spanish service was about to begin at Osteen's church, home to one of the largest congregations in the U.S. She immediately starts firing inside of the hallway. Multiple rounds are fired by her, at which point Officer Moreno of the Houston Police Department, as well as TABC Agent Herrera, return fire. She eventually falls to the ground. The seven-year-old child it falls to the ground as well from gunfire. Two weapons were recovered at the scene, including an AR-15. Anti-Semitic writings were found on the shooter. There was a sticker on the buttstock of the rifle that stated Palestine. Authorities say one of the weapons was bought legally in December. The shooter obtaining the guns despite her history of mental illness and arrest dating back to 2005 on charges, including assault. Houston's police chief directly told me they are now aware of the shooter's mental health history and they are delving into it. But when we directly press the FBI about how somebody with this kind of criminal history could get a hold of not just one but two guns, they sidestepped that question and said it is now a part of their larger investigation. Mireya Villarreal, ABC News, Houston, Texas.